In the last video, I showed you how to convert those push-down automaton to a context-free grammar that converts the same language. And in this video, I'd like to show an example of how those grammar generates the same words as a push-down automaton. As we noticed in the last video, the language the automaton accepts is a to the power of n, b to the power of n, where n is where n is greater than 0. So in this case, let me just take the word AABB as an example. We are beginning with the start symbol. And I have this rule that tells me that I have to replace the start symbol by this uh, strange looking non-terminal. And then for this non-terminal, I have um, two rules I can use. I could use this one, which would um, give me the empty string. Or, no, I can't, sorry, I can't use it because here's Q0 and here's Q1. So uh, the only rule I can use is this one. So I can replace this non-terminal symbols by A and by those two. So I get an A, and I get those two, Q0, A, Q1, Q1, stack symbol, Q1. And then um, I'm going on with this non-terminal, so Q0, Q1 with an A in between. I have those two rules I can choose from. And uh, this rule will generate me nothing, and I just can go on. It re resembles the transition to the Q1, where I'm done with reading A's. But I have only one A, and I want to generate another, so I, I'm going with this rule. And then I will keep the A that, was, that I already had. Then I will... I will replace um, this uh, this non-terminal by everything. Well, everything I've got here, so I will get a, and then all that stuff that's written there. And I will keep the the symbol that was already there. Then I keep the two A's. Um, I have those rule from Q0 to Q1, um, which will get me... Well, I don't want to generate another A, so I'm just... Uh, I just take this rule, so I will get... Epsilon is the same as nothing, but I will get a new symbol q1 a q1 and I'm left um, I will also keep the other stuff I had here then I have the transition from qa um, I have those non-terminal symbol that resembles a transition from Q1 to Q1 where I consume, where I pop the A and the only rule I have is this one that I can use. So I will get, uh, let me, maybe let me do this in color. So for this symbol, when I use this rule, I will get the B. wonder why I wrote Q oh, this this what looks like a two should be a one it's just um, badly written so I replace those non terminal symbol by the B and I will just um, keep the things that were already there and then I will use the same rule again
So I will replace this part by another B. Uh, sorry, I accidentally changed the size of my pen. And I will just keep what's there. And in the last step, I re will replace those non-terminal by, um, well, I can just use this rule, so I'm left with AABB. And that's exactly the word I liked to generate with this grammar.